the Red Back project um, is uh, an efficient way to try and um, improve the patient journey um, from the care home along the ambulance ride into the hospital um, and allow us to access their important documents relating to what their function is like, um, what their background medical problems are, um, the medications that they're on um, and whether they've got any kind of DNAR status. Um, and it allows us to have a quick way of looking through all of that and then managing their care more effectively. The patients have more of a chance of being treated within their own home due to the fact that we have all the information that we need to make a, a good clinical decision um, to contact GP, clin uh, community based teams um, and ensure that the patients are, are, are not taken to hospital inappropriately causing them stress, anxiety etc being stuck in the hospital. When obviously a resident's being told that they're going into hospital first thing they're they do worry about is their own personal belongings. Because most of the stuff's already pre-packed into the bags in the room, it's so much easier. Just grab the bag, the few bits and pieces that we have to obviously photocopy, put in, and that's it's done. Involving the Wolverhampton Local Authority, the CCG, the Ambulance Service and the community-based teams has been imperative. Um, it's been absolutely important to, to ensure that we can mitigate any issues that have arisen as they've arisen. I think it definitely has helped the treatment and transfer the majority of the time of our residents in hospital. It's definitely taken some work off us once they're in hospital because the hospital's got the information there, we're not being called constantly every time they move. That's brilliant idea. So it'll yeah. make a difference. Yeah, and it would be much easier to see what happens to it because mm -hmm. it gets taken off mm -hmm. here and it gets lost. So it's a good idea, brilliant.